Hi everybody, it's me Legarlax and I'm also known as Chino and Artie. Right now I am going to do a, a recent update on my reverse engineering. Um, I actually have two of these interactor cushion. Yes, I have two of them with extra amps. So I actually have the original one. The one that was just a backpack and it hurts your back. Aching back pain. I will never dismantle this bad boy. It's a collector's item. And there's even a part there that specifically works audio output for Super Nintendo to put in your surround sound speakers. And um, I actually dismantled them and took the effort to put it in my, you know, comfy chair. It's still visible here because I haven't put the cushion yet, the leftover cushion. The other one's in here behind. I just have to seal them up. So it's really going to put a thud on this. Yeah. You can feel the, if I load down the, the noise, I mean from the speakers, this is pure bass coming out from the 5.1. What I did was if you have a real tech audio, what you do, you split the audio from center and bass and then output it by getting one of these splitters, the LNR splits. If you know what I mean, message sender receivers. And you don't actually hear it. You just feel it. Like for example, um, I'm gonna, I gotta sit on it for a minute. I'm watching a clip on Terminator 2 and Terminator 1. You don't hear it, you will just feel it. See? It vibrates from here to there. That's why. I'm... And people have wondered well, that amp is really, really small. Yeah, because there was this guy named, um, I'm not, I'm, I, all I can say, he's from a Brit. And he this basically uh, scandaled my uncle in a way. But um, when it comes to speaker installation, um, when we do Mickey Mouse, we make sure it's Mickey Mouse done right. Make it happen. Not ever, ever, ever after. Make it forever, ever after. <laughs> um, this is Mickey Mouse work. So I hope you guys enjoyed what I did so far. Uh, if, you, if you guys had ideas to do this too, that would be great. I want you guys to give me a critique on this so far. Because this is my design. Um, well, I picked the chair. I decided to, um, you know, for me, I, had, I ended up putting like one of these bathroom rugs. I got to get a black one so the chair wouldn't be moving around so for me to run over the wires. Trust me, it, it really works with this kind of brand of, um, get them at Walmart. <laughs> but where did I get these, uh, uh, Christian Interactor Christian ones? I bought them at the, uh, I bought them at the Goodwill. I bought it at the Goodwill for only uh, $10 each. Well, $10 for one box, but the other one was $7.99. I don't get it, but hey, they have to scan by the code, not by quantity. But it's um, it's really, really worth it. It's the cushion edition. Basically, it was a very teared-down version of the original. And then after they had the original, they basically just uh, put cushion all around it and make it cost more to make it a multimedia. But it's always been multimedia. So, uh, what do you think of the setup? Uh, leave a comment if you leave a like or not like because obviously it's making a lot of thuds instead of uh, noise. It's really vibrating if you sit on that, you know? I mean, let me try it again. See? So this was my way of uh, reverse engineering um, something that cost me less than 20 bucks and plus the chair cost me only 35 bucks I remember I still have the price tag oh no it's not yeah goodwill shopping I mean uh, I'm not the first person who've done this I gotta admit I really thank you thank you so much uh, LGR and uh, I mean I was already doing unboxing reviews but you have the best subscribers man I gotta admit you know I mean I don't know if I was the first but I was just known for making PSPs and iPod reviews that are fake. <laughs> and until now, I still have frequent followers. And if there's anything you see that you need me to be reviewed, um, I'm going to take my time on this one. So, see, if there's any title here that you need me to, to um, review, just tell me. I will review it for you. I mean, LGR, you are the greatest. When you beat me to the punch, you already beat me to the punch. Those are the big box games. Now I got more big box games. Um, 
Uh, if you see anything and any idea that you want me to. Oh, I do have Syndicate Wars on the. Yeah, that's a collector's. Remember when they used to be called Bullfrog Entertainment? Uh, Sega GT for the PC. And atop that, I even have NASCAR Racer. Um, you remember that Fox TV show? They actually made a game out of it. And um, Daedalus Encounter. And my favorite Rainbow Six series was the Rainbow Six Vegas series, but the first one was still a classic. And this is my retro station. All Mortal Kombat fighting games out. And plus my flight yoke sticks if you need me to make reviews. There's my bobblehead. I hope you guys like me to be how I am in there. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's craftily made by taking one doll to another to make it match my... Yeah. But uh, I thank you guys for watching. And I... Um, shout outs to um, who got me employed with the company. Um, first, Viviana. Thank you for signing me in from Labor Now. Um, also, Ruben and Laura for um, being there for me for how I have my... Um, career now I'm going to be a career uh, working there because I actually enjoy my job at um, Garden Highway under the Department of USDA pack out I really appreciate you guys hey I work in a freezer can you handle that <laughs> and also um, I just want to say uh, what do you call shout out to Mr. Tuco and um, River White uh, Mario hey hit me up if you ha if you get a hold of Gabriel I miss talking to him you know because we need to catch up on what's going on I have a home theater set up that's going to be filling up on two walls, guaranteed two walls, when you have two projectors. So we're going to have a two um, drive-in movie night here, and I'm going to review that later today, tonight. And I have all these loose things I still have to maintain. Um, but I really thank you guys for watching, you know. Oh, there's my mother in the back, yeah. So uh, I'm going to take a nap. You're going to take a nap? Nap. Okay, you enjoy your nap. She wants to tell me she's taking a nap so I can keep an eye on her, you know. <laughs> yeah, and then um, I'm going to be putting up these new Sony speakers to, you know, to go over the Blu-ray because, hey, I have to Mickey Mouse it because these speakers don't even belong for this unit. Yeah, but um, thank you guys for watching and leave a comment.